Hey, welcome back, everybody. Sign here again with another episode on Kabbalahs. There we go. And I'm actually finally uh, taming that Despotosaur we saw a while ago. Oh, hey, you gave me a gift. Cool. So there's been a new interaction now with between uh, immersive taming and like Dino Hunger Meter to the point where a Despotosaur who's usually an extremely passive tame. I don't think he's close enough, or she's close enough. Uh, will actually attack you. That was really strange. I was not expecting that. Alright, 88.3%. Just like basically one more hand feeding, I think. And he'll be taken care of. Oh, frick. Nope, run. Holy crap, that gun. It's a different story. I will protect, you know, things that I'm trying to tame. Uh, but we're a high enough level now that, uh... Oh, he threw some stuff to me. Uh, I can open the blue crates up. Or pelt. Okay. And one of the things I got... 660% ascendant long neck. Uh, just get that on the ground so it decays quicker. Hey, you're probably ready to uh, to eat now, aren't you? Yep. And yeah, it's got the display to you, uh, malnutrition, or malnourishment, and look what his food does. So. Oh, is that that level 90? Hey, you. Yeah, it ate one of my bait arrows that I was shooting at the Despoto after I figured out that, uh, yeah, I can't get close to it until it it's blue. Alright, and basically just been beefing up uh, health and weight on this Denonicus. It's not combat mount. I don't see why I would, you know, be leveling up, like, melee damage. Oh, wow. All the stuff and things. Cool. But uh, we're up over the uh, little cabins right there. The abandoned houses. Ah, oh, you're like 1.8% of the way there. Come on, guy. Uh, the Despoto, I'm probably not going to bother trying to raise up for a while yet. Because of the, well, there's the malnourishment thing, and the fact that it takes a huge Rana saddle. And I'm a little ways away from being able to... Uh... Oh, hey, the Aloe won that fight. Wow, the Seal of Ice did a number on it, though. 90? 90. Okay, here we go. Really? That does not count as a weapon. Friggin' Soul Ball. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, no, the Seal of Ice did a number on that guy. Uh, let's go this way here, right? Up there, Bronto? Okay. Oh, hi. Oh. You know, I'll take some free arrows on an aloe brain. Oh, look at that. All right, then. Ah, Edmontosaur. Okay, cool. Few of them. Nice. Uh, if I'm getting attacked with something big, I know where to drag said thing. Although... Probably not going to be easy to get to. Ah, here we go. More abandoned structures. And lots more Tranodons. Okay. 180, 290. Wow. Oh man, it's a conca, really? <sighs> oh, that Tranodon's dead. 
Well, getting much. Oh, hi, Rex. <laughs> yeah, it saw me. Uh, duck in the house. Okay, nothing in here. All right, let's move over here. By the way, those are all citronal, which you can actually harvest up. Definitely recommend coming up here with a whip. Makes things so much easier. Uh, we've got water wheels down there, which is kind of cool. And then back here. Oh, you're you're not stuck though. Okay. Oh, dang it. Steel of Isis do this crap. They get underneath you. And then you're stuck in midair and you can't move. Dang it. Nope. Sideways. Thank you. Flash. Flash. Thank you. No, up. up. All right. And we're going to go in here for a while, I think. It's probably a little bit safer. All right. Um, let's see. Bugs. Okay. Oh, hey, it's Sora Felta. Um, right, well, that is a dead camera sore. Is that a griffin statue? I think that is, actually. Now we're, we're all the way up here now. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and hop down to this layer. Got some more runes up here, which is awesome. Like, I just love the, the runes and stuff on this map. They're very well done. All right, and... Is there anything underneath here? Doesn't really look like it. It's a bit embarrassing to get stuck down there. All right. Uh, do 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 do. What else we got going on here? That's this barrel staircase headed down. Looks like down to probably here. If I remember correctly. Yeah. And yes, you can ride a horse up the steps. Of course, the last time I was riding something up those steps, I got micro wrapped halfway up. And it didn't do much besides, you know, surprise me and then annoy me, but. All right. Where did everybody go? I mean, we're immune to fall damage, so that's good. But, uh, yeah. Trying to get a good luck, not a, not a bail. Okay, there's the seal of Isis. They're still hanging out where I went up the wall. Oh, they saw me. Hey. All right. Yeah, I think we're done there. There's a cave with resources and stuff behind them, but I don't want to fight my way through that stuff because, well, obvious reasons, right? Well, they're all the way over here now, though. Hmm. They'll come running when those two that are stuck inside, you know, see me. Hello, Petasaurus. Sora Pelta. They're actually relatively common in this area. 
which is good. And let's see, what else we got going on here? Oh, there's a Dilo, the swampy area. That is a Giga Titan. Level 100 Giga Titan. Fucking compies, go away. Why don't you try to bite me? That is a Herrerasaur. I'd really rather not, you know? Bugs, get out of here. Oh, oh, here comes the Giga Titan. Okay. Well, it just ate the combi. And I just got a full heal. What the heck? How many times are you going to full heal, you jerk? Okay, cool. And we got 128 polymer, which is awesome. That's the only reason I actually messed with that thing. They actually have a special move called Execute, where they pull you off the back of your mount and basically lock your head off. Yeah, it's, it's not fun. It also breaks every piece of armor you have. That's a Dynakyrus. Alright, so I'm over here, though, because... There's ruins here, too. Sure. Any treasure or anything in here, though? Doesn't look like it. Okay, now that Kairos is getting too close. Get away from the goose. Also, I'm too close to the water. I mean, Capros, you know. You take me right off the back of this thing. Alright, um... But I'm looking for a red panda. That's what I would really want. It's going to be kind of interesting to find around here. Oh, hello, Rex. Yeah, I think the Rex is going to win that fight. I hope we just... The water's a lot deeper than it looked. Freaking ants again. They're stubborn enough that if I ever stopped to actually look at something, they will just be right there on me. What are you fighting? Gargoylosaurus. Yeah. I don't think that little thing's going to survive. All right. That's an actual Equus. Huh. What was that? Torosaurus, that's a Arnoraptor. Okay. More seal of ice. That's great. How about we just uh, put some distance between us and them? I'm basically looking out for a little orange bundle of fur bouncing across the landscape. The good news is red pandas stand out pretty good. Bad news is freaking almost nighttime already. Wow, I'm surprised that horse didn't freak out. Well, that was unfortunate. Oh, 
another Carnoraptor? It is. A lot of casters down here. Another car. What the hell, man? Uh, that one seems to be. Uh, it's right next to a corpse, so it probably just ate. All right. So. Probably not going to find what I want to up here, but I mean, at least I can get a pretty decent view of the surroundings from up here. That might help a little bit, seeing as, you know, very soon I'm not going to be able to see anything. But it also seems to be relatively safe up here, so. Well, hello, Tranodon. Hanging out up here. Why is there a glow up ahead? See that right there? coming from now that I'm in the area with the lantern. Right, well. Yeah, I don't think this mission's going to be a success. Alright, so I have a kind of scary situation going on. I had this thing aggro on me, and it chased me into here. And now it keeps trying to get in. And if it goes all the way around, then uh, I'm SOL. down here, right? Like an abandoned temple or something. That's completely... I really like the, the design, but well, it's a little frightening right now. And I think my Denonicus is a bit bugged out right now, too. Yep. There it goes. Damn it. What are you doing? Ah, oh, idiot. Oh, wow, look at that. Okay, cool. But... All right. There's like nothing down here for it to have gone after to try to eat. Okay, I think we're safe from the Dynachyrus now. Look at that tree, though. That is awesome. I mean, cool area, but Hunk of Venator, okay. Going this way then. Raptors and Herrerasaur, okay. Oh! Cool, the Dinochirus is dead. Okay, Shally. Oh, there's blue glows up here. Latch, latch, okay, or not. Do 
Try again. And... Alright, so we've got stuff in here. Like more of the element shard rocks. Yeah, I've got ambergris on me, right? Here, you hold on to that. So it doesn't expire as quickly. Oh, Delta Tromaeus. X Delta Tromaeus. Okay. Anonychus. Level 30 female. Okay. Raptor. Oh, great. Still no luck finding a red panda. I did find, like, an abandoned house that was... I had not seen before. There's really nothing going on, though. Oh. 190 male. Hmm. Anonychus. Oh wow, the, the roar actually works on Dononicus. Oh. That's cool. Alright, can we get up? Oh help. Yep. Death. Nope, no, no. Crap. You Jerk! You utter bastard. Oh. There it is. It, yeah, my Denonicus is just, like, bugged. It's just sitting there attacking. Oh. Great. Um. <laughs> well. Uh, I was leveling up. Uh, wait, right? Yeah. How am I going to get down there in one piece? Oh, right here. Okay, cool. And it is still just... Yeah. It, it... I need to soul trap it here, I think, and then release it. Damn Giga Titan, they'll just grabbed hold of my mount and just backed right off the cliff. What the hell? If the sun hadn't come up right then, it would have been pretty, pretty painful trying to see what was going on down there. Uh, I need a glide suit. I really do. All right. I think that's an Alpha Herrerasaur over there. Right next to that blue tree I was at. Uh, yeah, that is an Alpha Herrerasaur. Okay. All right, well, we're going to give that thing white birth. Um... No, go away, Compy. What's that about? No, go away, compies. Oh, hey, there we go. Oh, that's an Alpha Raptor. Do I dare try it? I mean, pretty damaged, but uh, I got more max health than it does. I have more health than it has right now.
Quit playing freaking peekaboo with me, you jerk. Look, see the Pisces. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm a lot further north than I wanted to be, but yeah, when you're running for your life from a uh, Dynakyrus, you just. Okay, that's an answer. Go. Uh, yeah, you don't want to stop and look at the map. Hey, play this sword. ticks were hucking the ant backwards. It's kind of funny. Alright, and then I had two more levels. Okay. That. Go. Level 42 all of a sudden. Wow. Once you can start making, like, better quality equipment and whatnot, you start getting levels a lot quicker. Like, I got a level and a half just from uh, making a Donka saddle. And some Equus saddles. Hello, I see you. You're not orange, but you know what? Oh, I will take an event color. Wow, that was uh, a lot of progress right there. I don't need you hitting, you know, things on accident. Can I pet you yet? Aww. There we go. Yeah, you are like, wow, super bright. But if I can have a uh, red panda on my shoulders, I don't have to worry about things like Dynakyrus, which is, quite frankly, awesome. Those things are terrifying. All right. Or Pegos now, either. Red pandas uh, make you invisible to Pegos, which is kind of nice. Not compies, unfortunately. All right, so hell of a view from up here. Look, there's a Therzina right there. Home is that way. Quite a ways away from home right now. Alright, so we found uh, more ruins. Doesn't look like there's any, like, place for drops to uh, spawn in, though. Oh. 
Thirsty. It's the first time I don't know how long I've actually had to drink on this map because it rains so often. Oh, frick, ice. I knew you were going to come after me. Goliath. And another a 270 male Desplato. Uh the one I had before is a male as well, okay. Alright, so 57, 46 and a half ish. I'm overheating. Angatarama? Yeah. It's weird, the game freezes like that sometimes when I go to open my inventory. <laughs> Ooh, pick up. Alright. Thought that was something dead at first, and it's just a old gnarled tree root. Well, that's a day glow diplo, isn't it? Off to the swamp now. By the way, that's a green obelisk oh, right there. That's the terminal anyway. All right. Oh hell! Get up there. Are massive. Okay, so it looks like pretty standard on the uh, tributes required. There's a cave right there. It's not one I remember being in or not. Well, that's a Sukumimus. Okay. Oh, hey. I didn't get too turned around and run away from the Suko. Is this it? What I saw right here? Yep. Alright, what do we got in here?
Kind of reminds me of the uh, Fertile Lake area of uh, Apparition. Oh yeah, definitely get Apparition vibes out of this. Kind of cool. I like this. All right. Um, is there an entrance into this thing? Giant brick building here. I mean, got to be something, right? gonna be one of those walls I can't climb as a Dononicus. Up oh, there we go. All right, so we have our statue. We got a ton of crystal. Got a doorway. My Dononicus is too fat to fit through. so fat. How are you stuck now? There we go. Got wedged in. Do I have that sick life found on me still? I do not. Okay, I left, just left it at home. That's a mohawk on that horse. Nice and tranquil in here, isn't it? I mean, there's just nothing in here except for some fish and a whole lot of birds, you know. Singing. Yeah, I heard you, Compy. You know what? Where are you at? That's really weird. They ran by like they were scared of me. Freaking odd. Hi. Nope. Stop. So how am I going to deal with a Microraptor? Uh, easy way would be to do this, I guess, right? Oh, hell. Well, I want that back, but... So the crossbow I have with me... Uh, 720%. <laughs> 
I feel like I'm gonna kill whatever I shoot with it. It's, you know, tiny. What about that? Also, what is up with all the fog in here? Dung beetle. Aberrant one, but... Dung beetle. But, uh... You know, Donaticus, they don't poop. Aberrant Gigantopithecus, okay. More dung beetles. Wow, this is a hell of a cave to try to get my way back into now, isn't it? Although... Nice. I think there's probably another entrance. Akatina, 550, not tameable. Okay, yeah. What the hell? Freaking tiny that thing is. Also extremely high level, but look how tiny that thing is. Was. All right. A second. This is not the way I came in, so this still continues on. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, this is where we started the map at. Uh, I don't remember, but uh, I think it was like episode one. Like, yeah, there's a cave on this side, and then there's a cave over here. There's a blue drop, like, right there. Let's we'll see if it's actually around right now or not. The sand is like too bright after being in that cave though. Oh look, it's a Wacheria. Max level nonetheless. <laughs> sure, why not? And how much are you gonna get on that? 8%. Okay, yeah, I, I was making sure that I had enough bait to uh, complete the taming. Okay. All right. Why aren't you latching? Oh, well, I can always hop up over here. And no drop. Okay. Also, it could be a Venator. Oh, wow. Barely grabbed hold. I know, I startled you. It was good for a little bit of gaming effectiveness, though. You're taking a really long time to get hungry again. Apparently not all the palm trees are fake. Oh crap, we got hit with that bug. Where am I gonna end up at? Oh no. Wow, oh no. <laughs> That's not a good sign. All the way over here. Where I tamed this thing. All right, freaking Donatus bug. I. Oh, hey snake. Actually, I did want to get some silk anyway, and there are lamantry around here, so. Like I'm right next to it. I've got a uh, red panda now. We're fine. All right. That's with all the fog now, too. Oh, Procoptodon. Oxalia. Oxalia. 
chance. All right. Uh, couldn't get close enough in the cloud to, uh, or couldn't get close enough to hit it without getting into the cloud as well. How much luck did I just get, though? 302. I think I need 310 for a pair of boots I wanted to make. And let's see. Man, look at all the flowers, though. And they're not harvestable, though. Uh, is that a conca up there? Well, that's a saber coming towards me. Oh, that's an aloe over there. Okay. Ooh, Chunking. Eh, level 50. Are you still? Yeah, you're still on my butt. Okay. Hey. Right. No. Oh. Can I say I'm missing the first one? The second one. I don't know. I felt like it was like right there, you know, and then it wasn't. It's just Megalania everywhere up here. Is a uh, like a little, I don't want to call it like a dungeon, but it, it pretty much is, right? What? There you go. Oh, hey. You are very brightly colored. Oh, hell. Three saber teeth. Okay, and there's. Arthros, which is the main reason I have the gun. Although it worked pretty good on Giga Titans too, apparently. So, me. Pick it up. Thank you. Alright. That's where I wanted to go. There's that Arthro. Dang it, I can't go over any more to the right. Oh, there's a scorpion down there, too. I'm not too worried about the scorpion. There's our throw. Can you get a headshot? Maybe? Nope. <laughs> Dang it. Ah! This thing keeps spinning in place and rotating out of the way. And that did not kill it. What the hell? Oh, well, yeah, it's almost dead, though. There we go. All right. Um, I don't know where that thing is, though. That little, like, tunnel that I found. Let me further up that way. Or maybe it's further up that way. Oh, there's not much to it. It's just basically some resources. But it's kind of cool looking. Okay, you want to actually jump? There we go. And... Swing! All right. 
Okay, yeah, good job. Oh, why you bother doing that? Nothing comes out. Here we go. This is it. And up. Go the horse. Wow. You, okay, you did kind of fit through there. Yeah, here we go. But we can get sulfur here if we want. Uh, we got obsidian. And then we go down here. More sulfur obsidian. There's some metal. And there's nothing back there I've checked before. So. I'm going to mine up some sulfur. I'm just going to toss that coal on the ground, though, because that stuff gets extremely heavy. Yep. Uh, yeah, coal weighs one pound each. Yeah, definitely one of the safer places to get sulfur at. There's just nothing down here, uh, creature-wise, anyway. Well, congrats, sir. Kentro, you killed that Carno. walking through the corpse so I can harvest it. Alright, and... Level 50. Okay. Bit of a shame there, but oh well. So yeah, 302 silk. I have not seen any other Lamantria though. Hey, stuck aloes. They're angry too. There's like nothing down here, so. I wonder if I can find any Lamantria out here that got spooked from in there and flew out this way. Be nice and handy. I, I don't think it's gonna happen, so. Hey, how you done? Oh, hell. Stuck in the tree. Uh, not my greatest moment. Alright, um... Well, that's cool. I like that patterning. see anything else around here that strikes my fancy, so. Definitely a lot easier getting around the map when it doesn't teleport you on a Denonicus than a horse, though. The only thing that saved me was the from the Dinochirus was the Denonicus jump. You know, being able to just hurdle yourself way out into the void. 
And are you here? Nope. Dang. Another one over here. We might get lucky. Nope. Dang it. Me. There we go. If the only drop I found was a yellow. Too high for me, so. Ah, uh, there is that one. I can never find it, though. The one on the islands out here. Oh, wow. We actually ran out of stamina. There we go. No, don't grab to trees. Yeah, there are just so many hyenodons around here. Alright, well... Yeah, I can't remember exactly where that thing was. Get out of here, Bronco. Yosemite Baryonyx. Hmm, not bad. I think it was further south, so back this way a bit. Oop, that horse. Hello, found it. It's like, like a lance. I mean, not something I really ever use, honestly. The main thing I do with lances is I hold on to them until I need obsidian, and then I grind them down. <laughs> after all right and there's the mess hall all right oh yeah I uh we have ecos trees installed as well <laughs> it was dumping apparently you can put tree sap taps in the stumps you can actually have just a redwood with a set, you know, tree sap tap right next to your base. Kind of handy, actually. Oh, yeah. But you're still following me. So let's go ahead, get that dropped off, and that... Now here's a question. Does polymer go in the pantry? It does. And it does not affect the spoil timer at all. Okay. So I'm going to guess ambergris is the same thing, but they will go into this pantry. So just under an hour to 22 hours. And where's the ambergris at? There it is. Hour and a half becomes... One day, eleven hours. I can, I can 
I can get behind that. Alright, and... I don't think there's any other perishables around here, really. Let's see, there's that. Those. I think that was all the Apex drops I got, though. But I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. Uh, we're going to have to go do a, a better exploration of that uh, aberration cave. That's one of many on this map, actually. But, uh... Seemed like there was some pretty decent stuff in there. And pelt. There we go. So, we're not looking as poor anymore, but we're still... <laughs> we still ain't rich. But, thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and until the next one. Sign signing out. Have fun.